What's up guys, my name is Mike, for those who do not know me yet, I am a software engineer and I do Forex, I do machine learning and lately I was doing a lot of live streams on Facebook when I was coding the deep learning model, the neural network to predict the next candlestick on the Forex market. So using this technology, we can take advantage of binary options trading or maybe scalping. So anyway, I thought it would be fun to take all of those footage. It's 24 hour footage of me coding and put it into the nice clip with music. And of course, in the end of this video, I will show you the whole research with code and results so, so you can take this and use it in your advantage. Okay, so let's get started. And if you like the content, please remember to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and leave a comment. This kind of actions really help this channel to grow when it comes to YouTube algorithm. Okay, let's go.
Okay guys, so as I promised, this is the paper that I did during this research. Okay, so you need to go to my blog page. So it's called mikepapinski.github.io. So if you go here and scroll a little bit down, you will see the post predict forex candlestick patterns using Keras. So if you click on that one, you will see the whole research. So basically the class object to measure time, import data set, functions, different functions, chart visualization, converting to data time series, some plotting to the charts, feature engineering. What else do I got? That's a lot of information guys. So take your time, go to this page and read the whole research. So maybe you will learn something useful for you. Okay, here you can see how the model was training, the accuracy and the loss function. What else do we got? Okay, that's the importance of each feature after model is trained. Big data. Evaluate candle model. So basically function to evaluate if the model is successful or not. And yeah looks pretty nice so feel free go ahead to my page read the blog post and let me know in the comments what you think about this research and anyway thank you for watching and uh, see you soon